Hi, it's Jimmy from the Productive Engineer, and today we're going to be covering how to lock and unlock notes in Apple Notes, so stay tuned. Apple Notes is the default note-taking application for iOS and Mac. It is a great app uh, for capturing quick thoughts as well as longer form notes. However, some notes you'll want to potentially secure as obviously your notes are backed up into iCloud and people, if other people have access to your computer, they could become exposed. So being able to lock a note provides you an additional layer of security. And in this tutorial, we're going to show you how to both unlock and lock notes in Apple Notes. Now, before we get started, if you like this video, please click the like button as it helps out the channel. My channel is all about teaching you how to use applications to get your work done, whether it's Apple Notes, Evernote, Notion, Todoist, or a variety of other applications and services in the productivity space. My channel is dedicated to teaching you how to use them. So if you are interested, please click the subscribe button. And if you want to be notified when I release new videos, please click the bell. Thanks. Okay, let's get started. As you can see, I have a note here, my Apple Notes, and I want to lock it. So there's two ways I can do it. I can come in here and right click on the note and click lock note, or I can simply click the lock note button, come down and select lock note. Now when I do that, this is the first time I've ever locked a note in um, Apple Notes, it's going to prompt me for a password. I'm going to give it one. And I'm going to give it my hint, which if you've watched the movie Charlie the Chocolate Factory, you'll now know what that password is. This is just a, this is not a password I use anywhere else. It's just something I'm just using as a, for the sample. And I'll click set password to set that password. And now there's a password assigned, as you can see, there's a lock next to my note here that show as well as up here on the top that shows that this is a locked note that's currently unlocked. Now, if I want to lock my note, I can come up here and click close all locked notes and I'll do that. And now you can see my notes contents are hidden. The title's still visible, but everything in the body of the note is now password protected and locked. And the only way to unlock it is to come down here and type in my password and now it's unlocked again and if I want to lock it back again I can just go back close all locked notes and once again it's locked so that's how you lock a note and unlocking it is using your password to unlock it now the only thing I'll say here is once you've set up your password if you go to lock other notes it's going to use that password. So if I create a new note, for example, I'll call this note two and sample text for the body. And I come in here and I click lock note. If I click, notice it didn't prompt me for a password. That's because it's using the password I had to set up for the account for unlocking passwords. Now this password is different than your iCloud account. At least it definitely should be. And so when you, it's the password you set up on the first note that you, when you set up to lock. So the password I used here is now also for this note as well. Now, if I close and lock all my notes, notice that both these notes now, every note that I have in app, Apple Notes that is, that can be locked is now locked. Here, and I wanna unlock it, what I'll do is I simply will click on the note, come down here to the text box, and then I will type in the password that I set up on the first note and it unlocks the notes. It actually unlocks all my notes. So it's not a per note lock. It's a, um, while well, the locks are per note, I guess is why I say it. The password, there's one password that unlocks, locks or unlocks notes. And if you unlock one note, you unlock all the notes. So there's no way to sort of just like, I'm gonna leave every note locked except for one where I'm gonna leave it unlocked. Locking and unlocking notes is an all or nothing thing. So keep that in mind when you're unlocking your notes and also closing them. Uh, closing, there's no way to just lock a particular note, you're locking all your notes. So that is only one entry. 
close all lock notes. If you, when you click it, all the notes that you have that are capable of being locked are locked. And they all share the same password to unlock them. Now, if you wanted to remove a lock, you could click remove lock and you can type in the password of that lock. And now this one note that I just did that for no longer has a lock on it, but my first note still has its note. So you can individually remove locks from notes, but you can't individually lock and unlock notes. I hope that makes sense in terms of how I explained it. Now, let's say I wanted to change my password for locking notes. I can come in here to notes, hit preferences, and then down here at the bottom of my preferences, there's a lock notes section where I can either change the password that I use, so I can make a different password, or I can reset my password. I can click the reset button and then it's going to give me a little warning message that says here, this allows you to create a new password for your notes from now on. Notes that already have your password aren't affected. So this is like, so what this does to reset the password is for every new note I make going forward, it will have a different password. Whereas change password, if I click on that, that's going to change the password for all the existing locked notes. So this is sort of how you manage it. I would recommend for most people having one lock password is fine for all your notes. The way that Apple Notes is really designed was really to allow you to create a singular password that you could use to lock any notes that you want within Apple Notes. Well, I hope this was helpful for you. If you um, like this video, please click the like button as it helps out the channel. And if you want to see more videos on how to be more productive and productivity apps like Apple Notes and other apps, please click that subscribe button. And if you want to be notified when I release new videos, please click the bell. Thanks.